Alright guys, so I pretty much got the refrigerant lines all set up. Right now, what I need to do is remove the OEM heat exchanger. Um, I'm taking out as much coolant as I can. And then I'm probably most likely just going to end up taking out all these hoses. And I'm going to replace it with this AN16 hose. Larger hose is going to provide more flow. So it's pretty much going to run a bit cooler with more coolant flowing through it. What's going on guys? I'm here to give you another update on the car. So pretty much I installed the flex fuel kit. I also installed the high pressure fuel pump and the inline filter. So now, oh, and I also did the refrigerant lines for the chiller. As of now, I already removed the OEM heat exchanger and I'm working on installing the auxiliary tank. I still have to prep the tank and by prepping I mean wrap it in a neoprene rubber that way it doesn't condensate and sweat and then pretty much figure out the routing of the hoses from the tanks to the chiller to the intercooler and all that good stuff so yeah that's where I'm at right now I have two days left until tune luckily I already completed all the fuel system stuff low pressure fuel pump and high pressure fuel pump so pretty much right now it's just finishing the chiller I think if nothing goes wrong I will be able to finish so yeah guys stay tuned um, this was another update on the vehicle right now it looks like a mess i can't wait to get it back together and hopefully during the tune i'm gonna get some pretty good numbers so let's see what happens if you're new to the channel consider subscribing as i'm trying to build my car to beat a couple stock turbo records so yeah stay tuned